Hello guys, how are you? And welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to discuss about how you can use GPT-4 Omni with OpenAI API. So without further ado, let's jump right into the video. First of all, you will need to obtain OpenAI API key to do this because uh, all the authentication in API happen through OpenAI API keys. So for my case, uh, I will recommend that uh, first of all, let me just make this visible. You go to OpenAI.com openai.com you can just type that and then you go under products and then you can go to section under api and then there is api login there click on that and if you are able to not log in you will be prompted to log in so for mine it will take uh, some time and then i have options to choose between chatgpt and then i can choose uh, also api so because i'm not going to use chatgpt for the moment for the purpose of this video, I'm going to choose on the API key section. And then when I, when I click on it, I'm redirected to a page like this. So on this page, I can see that this is just a documentation on how to use uh, OpenAI API and another thing. You can read it at your own time. But if I look at uh, the left left side of this uh, section, I can see there is API keys. So I'm going to just, just choose on API keys. And then I'm... Um, Directed to a page with all the APIs that I've created and an option to create um, my own API, a new API key. So I'm going to just going to create a new API key for this video and then I'm going to call it test omni. I'm going to call it test omni. I will delete this API key after this video is recorded and posted on YouTube. So you should just get your own API key for the purposes of functionality because it will not work for you but it's go going to work for me. So uh, if I choose the, you can just choose the project and then also API, what API can do and what API can read, all of that. But for the purpose of making this video simple, I'll just uh, choose on all. And then I click on API key. And then it will take some time to, to do that, but then I can just copy the API key and then, uh, all of a sudden, I can just uh, come up here and uh, then uh, just uh, uh, the best thing I can do is just to, for example, uh, create my own, uh, for example, environmental variable. This is always the best thing to do. In fact, uh, in my main work environment or how I always do this is that I use what's so called the poetry. But I'm not going to use Poetry for the moment because I just don't want you to be bugged down with the entire setup of all these these things that are always sometimes maybe breaking changes or everything like that. So I'm going to create an environmental variable called .env, and then on API, OpenAI, API key. And then just paste my API key. So open your API key, API key, and then just paste my API key there. So uh, after pasting my API key, now I know that uh, everything is now set, and I can now just start programming my application using GPT-4 Omni because everybody who has just paid an amount of money to open AI will also automatically have access to GPT-4 Omni. So uh, to do this, uh, first of all, I need to load my environmental variables. First, I have to say import. Sorry for that, import OS, which is just a operating system. And then uh, there's uh, one thing that I need to install. I need to install OpenAI API key, OpenAI Python helper. I'm sorry for that. So if I want to, uh, um, for example, install OpenAI Python helper and just do pip install OpenAI and it will just be installed. For the purposes of uh, this video, I'll just install it globally. You can just check on my other videos on how I'm doing it through Poetry. One of the most important objects that you need to create when you're using OpenAI API is the messages. And these messages is and content mainly populated by either system, user, or assistant role. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go back and type OpenAI. 
open AI models. I'm going to check to that. And under models, I'm going to go to GPT 4.0 and then just copy it directly so that I don't make mistakes. I think I'm having some typo or something. And then I can just paste it there. And then run it again. And then it will take some time before it responds. And then the capital of the United States is Washington, D.C. So you can just, uh, for example, update this query or do any, any other thing. Well, and then the model will respond using GPT-4 Omni, as I've just told you. So that's how you can use GPT-4 Omni with OpenAI API. So guys, thanks you for watching. Until next time, always uh, subscribe and click on the notification bell so that you <coughs> get a video like this just for me in the near future. Thanks, bye.